Good afternoon folks, Big Bo here with another great travel trailer value from Parkway RV Center. Today we're going to review one that we have just taken in on trade. Folks had bought this new out of the Nashville, Tennessee area, traded it in on a motorhome. And it's an Imagine by Grand Design. This is more of an upscale travel trailer than what I usually shoot. Um, they bought it brand new, spent about $40,000 on it. I've got it today, it's a 2017 model, it's a 295RL with two slides, I've got it for $19.9. Guys, this is a pretty amazing travel trailer. This is pretty much a fifth wheel quality in a travel trailer package. Um, it is 33.8 feet, 33 feet 8 inches long, weighs 6,900 pounds, it is, it does have the Four Seasons Protection Package. And what does that mean? You get up to R40 insulation. Incredible number for a travel trailer. All enclosed underbelly, including tanks and, and plumbing. 35,000 BTU furnace. And it's even got two roof airs, which is something you very rarely see in a travel trailer and 50 amp power service, of course. And guys, this thing's amazing. You may have noticed the accent lighting on the front. You've got a power awning, outside speakers with blue accent lighting there. And um, guys, this is this is a beautiful camper. You know, if you're looking for a higher quality travel trailer, which is kind of hard to find, you know, most manufacturers concentrate on building them where they can sell them cheaper when they're new, but not grand design. Like I said, you're going to plop down 40 grand for one of these new. Got the awning topper. Spare on the back, of course. You know, this is designed for winter camping. It's been zero degree, actually below zero degree tested. It's been in uh, 15 degree temperatures for 24 hours with the factory heating. And it never got below 65 degrees in this camper. And they also did the same thing with 100 degree weather too. So guys, this thing is gonna handle pretty much whatever temperature you're going to find in North America within reason and that's something you really can't honestly say about a lot of travel trailers you know you usually have to buy a fifth wheel to get that kind of insulation factor it's got a power tongue jack deep cycle battery on the front like most modern trailers they're all going to 20 pound propane bottles it's got dual 20 pound bottles the reason being guys when you're at pro when you run out of propane, a lot of times there's not a place conveniently located that refills bottles, so you have to take it to a gas station to exchange it. And of course, if you've got a 30-pound bottle, that's not going to happen. So um, now all the newer manufacturers, which to me makes a lot of sense, are putting 20-pound bottles instead, just so that you can exchange it if you can't find a place to refill it. But anyway, guys, 11-foot power awning. Let's look inside. I'm, I'm just on a jump box right now, so I don't have it plugged into power. But I do have the lights on. Got the metal steps going in. These are the sturdier ones. Beautiful interior, folks. Look at that uh, crowned roof. Eliminates standing water, and plus it makes a little bit more aerodynamic to tow, which helps your fuel mileage. Perfect couples model. I mean, you got anything and everything you could want in a 33 and a half foot travel trailer. You've got a leather, and this is all top notch. Everything in this thing, folks, is top notch for a travel trailer. It's got a fireplace, leather furniture, leather sleeper sofa. You've got uh, heated recliners with accent lights, table and chairs. Got the nice countertops, got the island kitchen, which very nice in a travel trailer. You've got a uh, pantry. And it's a motion detected light, by the way. And you've also got one of those when you first walk in. I mean, guys, this is a uh, stainless steel appliances. Beautiful woodwork and accents in here. Eight cubic foot Norcold refrigerator freezer. It's running on gas right now and it's already getting cold. 
Even though you can't see it right now, there's also accent lights in here for nighttime. But you're not going to see that till it gets dark and you cut some of these lights off. Beautiful living area. I mean, tons of space here. Sit four here, sit two here. You got recliners right across from the TV. You've got a fireplace which you can set for the effect or as an auxiliary 5100 BTU heater which will cool or heat this whole area, your living space, your kitchen and living room very easily. Of course, obviously I don't have it on right now since so I'm just hooked up to 12 volt, not 110. That is 110 just like your recliners. LED lights. It's got a 15,000 BTU ducted roof air and an additional bedroom 13,500 BTU non-ducted unit. And of course, it's got, like I said, 50 amp service. So um, you've got plenty of amperage to pull both those airs and everything else. Power on and control slide controls right here. Tank monitors, one easy location. You got uh, the, it's got the king jack where you don't have to crank it up and down. You just turn it on for your uh, antenna for your TV. Open this up. You've got a walkthrough bathroom, China RV toilet. Nice tall ceiling. You can see around the skylight. I don't see any signs of water intrusion or leaks. Sorry, I guess I should open this up before I shot the video. This is a magnetic catch, too. That's just a safety latch. You got a little nice neo angle shower, which for this size camper is plenty. Vanity area, medicine cabinet. And of course, you've got a solid sliding door if you want to completely separate the bedroom from the bathroom. Very nice 60 by 80 Queen Island bed. Very comfortable, uh, thick mattress. Looks like they got a memory foam pad on it. There's your additional AC. Beautiful woodwork in here. I love the colors. Crowned roof. I mean, everything about this coach is nice. And even if you still have vents in here, so even if you just want to run one air, you're still getting air conditioning in the bedroom. Of course, power vent fan. Um, wow. Guys, this is, like I said, this is just a very high-end trailer. I know it's not going to be for everyone. You may be on a budget, but if you just want high quality, this is a great buy. And be honest with you, I've already done my research. This is the lowest price, 17 grand design imagined on the internet that I could find. And it's not perfect. You know, it is a used camper. Hasn't been used much, but it's been used a little bit. I noticed a couple little spots right there on the cabinet. On the side of the cabinet right there. That's just part of buying used, guys. If it's got a ding, a den, a scratch, if that bothers you, then I probably wouldn't buy used. I'd go spend 40 grand buy a new one. But guys, this is a nice little camper. And here's the thing. If you bought it brand new and you financed it, been paying on it for three years, you're still going to owe $30,000 on it. You couldn't afford to sell it for nineteen nine dollars unless you put $10,000 out of your savings in with it to pay it off. But it's nineteen nine dollars with a 90-day warranty, plus we go through our world-famous four-page inspection process. So you, so you don't have any problems when you pick it up. The way it works after you purchase this RV, we go through this unit, and I've got a copy of our inspection process. They all, I'll link it below in the video description. I've also got a, a physical copy in the unit as well. And one on my website you can look at. But look at that inspection sheet. Look at everything that we go over and guarantee to work on it for the price you pay. Anything we find wrong with it that's on that four-page list is repaired at no additional cost to you. So in other words, folks, for $19.9 plus tax, you get a fully functional 2017 Grand Design 295. Uh, to a uh, $29.50, I should say. RL, RL, fully functional with a warranty, all this in writing, and many more benefits. $19.9 plus tax. And guys, I'm looking at 2016s on RV Trader, just like this $28,000, $27,000. Uh, 17s for 30 grand plus. Be honest with you, these things bring so much money used. Well, everywhere else anyway. I don't know why people just don't just go spend an extra 10 grand buy a new one. But this one's half price, guys. Half price. Beautiful condition with a warranty. With all the benefits that you come to expect from Parkway RV Center. The inspection, the 90-day warranty that we purchase on your behalf, accepted at a network, large network of dealers. 
nationwide through Easy Care, largest aftermarket warranty company in the in the business. Many of you have probably heard of. And you get that included for $19.9, the 90 day, and you can extend it very affordably. If you want a price on that, give us a call. We'll get you a quote on a year, two year, three year, no obligation. Nice camper, folks. Uh, if you're interested, come and look at it. I strongly suggest you call before coming to look to make sure it is available. Because here's the thing, guys. You're like everybody else. When you see a particular camper that you like and the model number you like, you're going to Google it or search it on whatever search engine you use on your phone or computer. And, you know, the first things you're going to look at is the lowest priced ones. Well, this is it. You Google 2017 Grand Design Imagine 295 RL. This one's going to pull up first because it's, the, or this one's the one you're going to look at first because it's the lowest priced. And it's as nice as the ones that are $10,000 more. And you get benefits that the other ones for $10,000 or plus more don't have. They don't go through the four-page inspection process. There's not a dealer in the country that goes through a thorough inspection process that we do. But other dealers haven't been around selling nothing but used RVs for 51 years either. This is what our customers want, deserve, and expect. And we give that to you and still keep our prices very affordable. We don't nickel and dime you to death with extra fees. The price, the sales tax, that's it. Haggle free, easy, simple, done. Easiest used RV transaction you'll ever have. And uh, we have financing available with approved credit and down payment. If you got questions about that, give us a call. But 19.9, you get the inspection, you get the 90 day warranty. You get uh, other nice benefits too. You get uh, after this unit is purchased, it goes through service. If you want to know the current lead time for a travel trailer checkout, which isn't long at all, guys, give us a call. And also ask your salesperson to give you a sales tax estimate. Everybody's got to pay tax. Sometimes you pay it here. Sometimes you pay it when you tag and title it. Depends on a couple of different factors, what state you live in and how you're paying for it. Don't play games with that. Don't assume anything. Get that estimate so you know exactly what you're paying for this camper. You know, we're not like other dealers. We don't tack on thousands of dollars of dock fees, prep fees, freight fees, and all that nonsense. Inspection fees. and, and They got one now, a new one, that's $700 at Ripoff World. The happy camper fee. No. <laughs> I wouldn't be a happy camper if I had to pay $700 extra. And it's all 100% dealer profit. Like I said, 199 plus tax, that's it. You get the warranty, the inspection. After this unit's been through the inspection, which is done after purchase, my cleaning crew gets in here and cleans it inside and out for you. We do a final walkthrough if we're happy with everything. We'll call you to set up an appointment to pick up your new-to-you Grand Design Imagine. And I don't know about you, every time I see Imagine, I keep thinking of John Lennon for some reason, but I get that song stuck in my head now after I do this video. <laughs> anyway, after purchase, it's going to be cleaned up, inspected, ready to go for you. We're going to call you to set up an appointment to pick up your new to you grand design. When you arrive here at the appointed time, the tech that checked it out, or my walkthrough expert, Preston, will go through this coach with you with a abridged version of our checklist and be checking every individual system off as he shows you how to operate it, and more importantly, that it operates or functions correctly. And he'll show you any repairs that had to be made, give you tips, tricks, and pointers, help you hook it to your vehicle, and more. We do have weight distribution hitches and sway controls in stock. If you want a price on that, give us a call. If you're not sure what kind of safety equipment you need for your vehicle, give, us, give one of my sales experts a call. And they'll make a recommendation. Of course, you will need to know what your vehicle can tow. I've made that really easy for you, too. Go down to the video description below. I have a link to our free interactive tow guide that will tell you what your vehicle can tow. And unlike just looking at the dry weight, which is 6,900 pounds, by the way, it's going to also add for luggage, food, water, propane. Because a lot of people forget to add that. Like, say this thing weighs 6,900 pounds. Your truck is rated for seven. That sounds like you can tow it, but you can't because you're going to add a few hundred pounds of luggage, food, water, and propane in here. My tow guide accounts for that. 
So, uh, you know, you can look that up. It's free of charge, no obligation. It's not like you have to, you don't have to put in your email or phone number or nothing like that to use it. You just click on it, put your vehicle information in. It'll show you what you can tow, and then you can even push a button and show you every towable RV on my lot that your vehicle's rated to tow. And like I said, it keeps in account the extra weight of what you're going to put in it. Very, very handy feature, guys. And of course, you know, you always want to verify it with your vehicle dealer just to make sure it's a third party service. It is deemed reliable, but not guaranteed. And not every vehicle is in there. Um, some oddball vehicles are not in there. Um, or vehicles that really aren't made to tow are not in there. I had a, uh, one of my viewers asked me about a Kia Sedona. Of course, it was rated for a thousand pounds, so it's, they didn't even bother to put it in the tow guide. But nothing wrong with having one. It's just it's not really made for towing. Um, but um, at least that year model, anyway. I'm sure the newer ones are, are a little probably probably I'll tow a little bit more, but you're not going to tow anything like this. This is more or less designed for medium duty trucks and medium duty SUVs. At might as well say seven thousand pounds. So anyway, make sure you check that out. You know that is one thing that we can't tell you what your vehicle can tow. We just refer you to the tow guide um, because you you know you can ask ten different RV dealers what your vehicle can tow. You're going to hear ten different answers. So, and if you can't find it, always verify with your vehicle dealer too better be safe than sorry never go over i don't care what people tell you i'm talking from 22 years of experience and many many years towing rvs for a living never go over your vehicle's recommended towing capacity you know if it's if you can't tow it either go to a lighter weight camper or upgrade your tow vehicle don't ever chance it guys it's not worth it it's not worth the danger to you and your family it's not worth the danger to anybody else that's on the road um i've seen some pretty bad wrecks over the years with rvs and you know generally it's really safe if you've got the right equipment though do not take shortcuts if you need weight distribution bars sway control get it don't don't chance it you know obviously if you're towing something like this with a one ton diesel dually you, you're fine without that stuff but if you're towing it with a half ton truck yeah you probably need it Get your brake controller put in before you even think about uh, camper shopping. If you don't have one from the factory, go ahead and stop all or truck accessory store. Go ahead and get you a good brake controller put in because you're going to need it. In fact, it's a law. Because um, unfortunately, that's one thing we can't do is install brake controllers. But there's plenty of places you can have that done. That way you're one step ahead of everything you need to, be a, to have a safe tow. Anyway, guys, if you got any questions about this or, or towing in general, give us a call. 706-965-7929. And please call before coming to look again to verify availability. I'll put a link below in the video description to my used travel trailer page on my website. I've got a great selection. More arriving every day of some great used travel trailers. Fraction of the cost of, an, of a new one. And you get something like this, guys. You pull it up next to a 2020 Imagine. You can't tell a bit of difference except this one's half price. Besides a few little nicks and scratches and stuff like that, which is normal on a three-year-old camper. I like this floor, too. There's not any. Well, there's a little bit of carpet, but the main walkway is all that um, linoleum floor, so it's easy to clean. If you have any questions, call us. Email us sales at parkwayrvcenter.com subscribe to my youtube channel nationwide deliveries available and like i said financing is also available with approved credit and down payment and if you got any questions about any of that give us a call thank you for watching and look forward to seeing everybody here in beautiful ringgold georgia